this is Mike Murphy with Next Foils. Now that you can get up on your hydrofoil, you can taxi it, you can steer it. Now we're going to teach you the fun part, how to fly it. Well, now that you've learned how to do a deep water start, you've learned how to taxi it, you've learned how to steer it, it's time for dessert. You get to learn how to fly it. When you learn how to fly it, my suggestion would be to move back on the seat Oh, a couple inches is going to make it fly easier. Basically what you do is you lower your hands, you sit up, it flies. And you don't want to go too high. You've only got like a 32 inch strut. If you go 33 inches, you're going to fly out the top. So you basically do here what I'm doing. You lower your hands, you start to go up, you raise it, you go back down. You lower, you go up, you raise it, you go back down. You want to do this at probably about 13, 14 miles an hour. You want to keep your head up. You don't want to look down. All those little mistakes you made when you were learning with that ski on the water, you're going to be amazed at how much that those mistakes have been magnified. When you're in the air, you barely pull on a rope. Man, that thing's going to launch. If you lean, you're going to fall. You want to steer it with your knees. So you got to remember the basics when you fly. Don't try to fly it real high for a long time. Take it very easy. And good luck. Have a good ride.